When Dr. Russ Carter sees patients with heart failure, often their quality of life is not good. The symptoms of heart failure can be pretty terrible. I mean, you get so short of breath that you, you can't breathe even when you're sitting in a chair. And people, especially those people who have what we call class four symptoms, which prevent them from doing anything. They can't get up and walk across the room. For patients with heart failure, this pump called the HeartMate can help them lead a more normal life and possibly buy them more time while they're waiting for a transplant. The pump is surgically implanted in the abdominal area to help pump blood when the heart is too weak to do the job. But some patients have complained that it's uncomfortable and noisy. And for doctors, the pump's numerous moving parts are cause for concern. You're not able to get in there and do maintenance to the device so that after 18 months or two years, the older device would wear out, especially in a larger patient that had larger demand. Now, a new generation of HeartMate is in a clinical trial. It's smaller, quieter, and simpler than its predecessor. It solves most of those problems by its simplicity. In terms of patient satisfaction, I think it's much better. They're much more satisfied with this device uh, because it's more comfortable primarily. Both HeartMate pumps basically function the same way. They pump blood from the left weakened ventricle of the heart to the aorta, the main artery feeding blood to the entire body. The newer pump has only one moving part. Doctors hope this simpler design will mean the pump will last longer. After surgery, the patient wears an external battery pack and system controller to keep the pump running. Right now, the new generation of the HeartMate pump is available only to patients enrolled in the clinical trial, which will run for about two more years. I think if the new device works out, if, if it's as good as we think it is, that it's going to revolutionize the care of heart failure. It is a solution that, that uh, allows people to feel better. And, th and that's what it's all about, is, is trying to treat the patient's symptoms and give them a better quality of life. For Smart Medicine, I'm Rod Storns.